catching him up on the story of the trip I went on with my family. I learned so much. I learned about camping and hiking and fishing and even about my family. It was a lot of fun. It's so cool that you got to go fishing, Callie. I would love to learn how to fish. How did you figure it out? You have to follow the steps. If you have a grown-up take you fishing, I'm sure you'll catch some fish. One hint though, be very patient. I wasn't at first, but I finally caught a fish. Wow, that reminds me of the Bible story where Jesus helped the disciples catch a lot of fish. You're right. I'm learning so much from our Bible stories. So I'm so happy you like them too. Do you know what happened after that? Hmm, let's find out what happened next together. It's time for our Bible story. It's time to learn another wonderful story about Jesus. After rising up back to life, Jesus showed himself to his friends. But now the time had come for Jesus to leave the disciples and return to be with God. We call the place where God is heaven. So now the disciples are left alone with all this wonderful news to share with the world. The disciples were sad, but they had to remember everything Jesus taught them to keep Jesus with them, even when they couldn't see him anymore. Jesus promised that they wouldn't really be alone. Jesus said he would be with them wherever they went because he would send a helper called the Holy Spirit. With the Holy Spirit's help, the disciples would always have Jesus with them to encourage them and to help them. Jesus invited his friends to go and tell the story of Jesus to everyone, everywhere. He reminded them that they could have the ability to help others be a part of Jesus' story too. They could teach others to obey everything Jesus taught, just like they had done while Jesus was still with them. The great news is that the Holy Spirit is also our helper, sent by God, who makes us bold and strong to tell others about Jesus. The Holy Spirit even helps us to live a life that Jesus is happy with. When we invite Jesus to be a part of our story, he can change our lives, and he gives us the Holy Spirit to help us as we grow. Every day we spend with Jesus, we have a chance to get stronger and live just like Jesus did. That has got to be the best news ever, that we are not alone. Sometimes it's hard being a kid because we are so little and young. We might feel like we're not strong enough to do a lot of things. But when it comes to talking to people about Jesus or living my life the way God wants me to, I'm so happy to know that Jesus makes us strong. Stronger than the Hulk or Wonder Woman or Superman because I, because we have Jesus. Maybe we can't lift super heavy things or fly around, but we can do other cool things. We can rise up whenever we're feeling down or something bad happens to us because the Holy Spirit helps us and Jesus is always with us. We are stronger with Jesus. We are stronger with Jesus. Say it together with me. We are stronger with Jesus. Yay! That was awesome. Friends, I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in today and growing with me. You, my friends, are super duper awesome. I hope you believe that. 